Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Vanessa Rosana. If you guys are not subscribed to my channel, in today's video, I'm going to be doing some like review and a makeup tutorial that I did using the 4PX Jeffree Star Artistry Palette. So I purchased this palette. I got really excited when I got this palette. So let's open this thing up so you guys can see the colors. So in the front cover, it got like these photographic designs in the front. And it comes like a big mirror right here so you guys can see. So I got this palette since I don't have colors like these, like these pinky tones. Well, I mean, I had in like this mini palette by Food of Beauty, the Coral Obsessions palette. And so yeah, it comes with 30 shades, 12 shimmers, and 18 matte shades. And yeah, I'm going to be showing you guys some makeup tutorial that I did. Some like coral peachy eyes, you know. You can do a lot of different eye looks with this. It's really pretty, some like olive green eyes you could do right here in the bottom. So you guys want to see this eye look that I created? Please continue watching and see you through the tutorial, guys. Hey guys, so now to get started, so I'm going to quickly prep my skin and all, so we can get started with the Morphe palette and the X Jet Free Star palette. So I'm applying some Vaseline, just a little bit, where I'm really dry. So my face is really dry right now. Especially in my nose area for some reason. I don't know why. So I just apply like teeny a bit amount because I don't want to like try not to get like you know like greasy. And now for some Bailey 2 Cream Moisturizing Balm. And for some eye cream, the Origins Brighten and Deep Puff. So I'm gonna apply some of this Lip Glowy Balm by Laneige. Keeps your lips like glowy. So now for some concealer, my Too Faced Born This Way concealer in the shade Vanilla. Quickly blend this and set it with some Laura Versace translucent powder. So now I'm just setting this concealer using my Morphe 14 brush. So now for the exciting part, I'm going to be doing some eye look that I created. So I already swatched the colors and they're really pretty, honestly. So the first shade I'm going to grab is Honest True, this shade right here. Start applying this in the crease using my Morphe 441 brush. Honestly, I just feel like it got some fallout, but as long as the pigment shows up, that's why I like to do my eyeshadows first. So now I'm just building the layer. So now I'm going to grab this shade, which is Boss Angeles. Using the same brush, I'm going to be applying this on the crease. So now I'm going to with the shape Boss Angeles. Now using my Morphe M433 brush, I'm going to grab this shade, which is Calabasas. Start applying this in the outer V to the crease. After the eyes, I might as well do some full glam. See this fella? I mean, <laughs> but I love the pigment. So I always like to build up colors. 
Back with my Morphean 441, I'm going to blend my upper crease. So now using my Sephora Collection number 13 brush, I'm going to quickly cut my crease using my Too Faced Born This Way Concealer. Quickly blend this with my finger. Now to set with some Laura Mousse translucent powder using my Morphe E14 brush. Back with my Morphe M433, I'm gonna grab the shade Calabasas. Applying this in the outer V. Now I'm just blending my outer V and my crease. Now to start smoking it out more on the outer V, I'm going to grab this dark brown shade, which is High Dude, using the Morphe M433. Start blending this. And back with my Morphe in 441, just blend this. Now to whip my Morphe M167 brush with some water spray. And on the eyelid, I'm going to grab this shade right here, which is Dogma. Now using my Real Techniques brush, I'm going to grab this white matte shade, which is Lynn. So for primer, I'm going to be using my Too Faced Hangover primer. And now for some Becca Cosmetics on the right brightening corrector. In the shade medium to deep. And now for some foundation, I'm going to be using my NARS Radiant Foundation in the shade Punjab. So now I'm playing it back in my hand, start applying some foundation. And buffing this with my Morphe 439 brush. Now to apply my Too Faced Born This Way Concealer in the shade Vanilla. So now I'm going to start buffing this with my Morphe 173 brush. So 
So I purchased the palette, but I didn't get the the setting spray because I just got a new Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. But I do want to try that that setting mist though, cause the Jeffree Star X Morphe setting mist. Oh, munches! Look at these colors that they're applying foundation, concealer. I'm loving these eyeshadows. So pretty. I feel like I'm gonna be using this a lot more. So now I'm just blending this with my Morphe Beauty Blender. Make sure there's no harsh lines. Now to set my under eyes with my Makeup Forever Ultra HD and number two, <coughs> this yellow shade. And I like to keep the sponge like dry, not damp, cause the powder like moves around. But it definitely sets and like keeps it smooth. So now I'm just buffing this using my Morphe M334 brush. Damn, my face looks smooth after applying a bit of Vaseline. So now to set my face, I'm going to be using my Too Faced Peach Perfect Mattifying Translucent Powder. So if you feel like your face is really dry, just apply just a teensy bit amount of Vaseline, especially in the winter time. Just so want to make sure you set well the face. I don't know if, I, if you get greasy though. I'll never try this. It's my first time. Just gotta set your face well. Now back with the Artistry palette, I'm going to grab the shade Boss Angeles. Start applying this in the lower lashes using my Morphe 213 brush. Oh munches, these colors are so pretty and pigmented. Now to grab the shade Calabasas. So now to quickly set my brows with some Gimme Brow by Benefit. This is in number 5. Have my brows a little extra. And I also dip my brows using the Brow by Benefit and number 5. So now to start bronzing my face with my Tarte Amazonian Clay Bronzer. The shade Hotel Hires. Now I'll be using my Morphe 447 brush. Start bronzing my face. I love this brush. You can easily blend with this. So I'm going to quickly buff this up. Set up baking right here. I just to like lighten it up. With my beauty blender. And now for some blush. I'm going to be using my California blush by Benefit. And I'm using my Morphe 500 brush. Now to wet my Morphe 510 brush, some water spray. And for some highlighting, I'm going to be using my Dandelion Twinkle Highlighter by Benefit. This is some soft highlighting, nothing too crazy. And I end up applying a lot anyways.
Now for some eyeliner, using my Morphe Gel Eyeliner in the shade Jet. Now I'm going to be using my Sephora Collection number 22 brush. Now to curl my lashes with my MAC curler. And for some mascara, I'll be using my Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. So now to light up my lips with my Sephora Collection Gel Lip Liner in number 4. And for some lipstick, I'm going to be using the Huda Beauty Demi Matte Lipsticks. This is in Chica. And last but not least, some Glad and Glow Glow Setter Makeup Setting Spray. Now to say guys, so this coral peachy eye look that I created using this Morphe X Jeffree Star Artistry Palette. And what do I think about this palette? Honestly, I love this palette. I'm going to be using this probably a lot. You can do a lot of like different eye looks with this. And if you guys like these kind of tones, I say you should get this palette. And that is it guys for this makeup tutorial and this review. And if you guys really like this video, please give it a huge thumbs up. And see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.